Hello everyone and thank you so much for joining me today. I'm Serena and today I'm going to go over the August bestsellers and favorites from my YouTube channel. These are always fun to do. It's just a nice little recap of the month and that way you guys can see what the best sellers are from the month and see what other people are buying. I pull all this data from my LTK analytics as well as from my YouTube analytics and see you know what the top sellers are that way you can see too and i'm sure there are a lot of you who have purchased some of these items so if you have drop me a note down below in the comment section let me know what you bought and if you're loving it as well and as always everything that i mention and show in today's video will be listed down in the description box below and it will also pop up on the screen in the youtube shopping links so whichever is easier for you to shop you got multiple ways to get there and yes i'm in a little bit different spot here in my filming room i used to film here all the time back in the beginning of my channel i would do my try-ons and do all my talking sitting here uh, on this little sofa that's in my room y'all never see this anymore because it's on the opposite wall from where my closet wall is but I just thought I would sit here today for something different and go over the top 10. And yes, it is very dark today and I've got some shadows because of course, as soon as I got ready to start filming, the skies grew dark and the wind started blowing and we're about to have a storm, but I'm gonna press on through. Hopefully I don't lose power. But let's start out with what is number 10 on the best sellers from this month of August. And it is this little popover puff sleeve top from Time and True at Walmart. And I picked this up in the black plaid. Yes, as some of you pointed out, the stitching on this, this neck is gathered and it's got a very short little frilled neckline there. And the stitching is not right on this one that I picked up, causing it to have like a pulled look on the pattern so i'm going to return this and hopefully get it in another pattern or one that's not messed up in this way but hopefully the ones that you ordered were not messed up <laughs> i picked this up at my local walmart and let me see if i've still got the tag well shoot i took the tag off of it so i guess i'm not returning it but i know this was less than 20 dollars, and it's a cotton and it's very lightweight the perfect little piece to wear now while it's still hot but you want to pull in some fall vibes and this did come in additional colors like an orange and a floral as well so back in july i think it was the, toward the end of july i did this video which was all about different bras like different everyday bras and i tried them on for you guys under a tight fitting t-shirt just to show you how each one fit differently and if you haven't watched that be sure to go and watch it because uh, a lot of people really enjoyed it and found it helpful but one of August's bestsellers actually came from that video. I guess that video got a lot of views in August, and it is this bra from Wacol. It is the Back Appeal bra, and it's called the Back Appeal bra because it has a wider band in the back, and the straps are set closer in on your back so you can wear it easily with sleeveless tops and not one worry about your straps you know hanging out and showing when you're wearing like a tank top or something i have worn this bra a ton i can attest to the fact that it works it is perfect to wear with most tank tops if it's a true like racerback tank top it probably wouldn't work you would need a racerback bra but if it's just a regular tank top this works perfectly and i wear it even when i'm not wearing a tank top it's very comfortable fits me my size perfectly highly recommend and it looks like a lot of you have bought this bra so if you have let me know how you're liking it now the item that is number eight on the best sellers is a surprise to me when i started pulling my data together because i got a lot of comments on this item and i got the feeling that a lot of people just really didn't like them but i guess a lot of you did because they're in the top 10 list and that is these cuffed jeans from free assembly also from walmart 
I'm wearing these in a size six. I probably could have worn a size four, but I've been sizing up in free assembly because I feel like their denim especially, you know, it's kind of stiff. It doesn't have a lot of stretch to it or, or any give at all. So I have been going up, but I could have worn a four in these. And I don't know if that's from them just running a little bit bigger or me losing some inches lately. I have been on a new workout program and really watching my diet and adding in more protein, fewer carbs, cutting out sugar almost entirely. And I've been adding in weights to my workouts and my body composition has changed dramatically in the last six weeks or so and I can really tell it when I put on jeans because jeans that used to be snug or tight on me are now loose even though the scale hasn't really moved that much I'm only two or three pounds down on the scale I'm seeing a bigger difference in the way things fit but that's a topic for another video but these jeans are super cute and the cuffed style in these is very on trend for fall 2024 so if that's something you would like to try but not spend a ton of money on this is a great pair for you if you enjoy videos like these where i run down the best sellers and, and or my favorites please give this video a thumbs up and drop me a note down below letting me know if you want to see these every month Coming in at number seven on this month's bestsellers from my channel is the Scoop Blazer. <laughs> I have this in so many colors. This fall, they came out with two new colors, this really pretty burgundy kind of plum color and also a deep green. I also picked that one up. These are just the best little blazers to have because they're soft they're knit, they don't wrinkle. You can wad these up, throw them in a suitcase, travel with them, and they come out just fine. They wash and wear beautifully. And I wear them in a, my true size small, and they feel like a comfy sweater or hoodie, but they look like a blazer. So they're just the most versatile and comfortable pieces that you can have. And Scoop has had these for several years now, and I understand why they bring them back every season in new colors, because they are that good. And they are that scuba knit fabric. And they're actually, this one is actually more purple in person than what is coming across. It looks like a brick red. It's probably to do with the lighting in here and the darkness outside, but it is more of a plum color than the red that it seems to be coming across on camera. At any rate, this is number seven on this month best-selling list. Coming in at number six on the top sellers list is this little blouse from Free Assembly. This is the best blouse just to pick up and go with anything really. It's 100% cotton. It's got the little ruffle around the stand-up neckline and the ruffle comes down the front of the button placket and around the sleeves. I do get comments about ruffles <laughs> saying that they're for children and I look silly wearing ruffles. You know, I'm too old to wear the ruffles. Here in the South anyway, ruffles are just a feminine detail. You see women of all ages wearing tops or skirts or dresses that have some kind of ruffle detail. So no, it's not an age thing. It may be different where you are, but no, any age can wear this. And you know, all those old rules about what's appropriate for women over 40 or over 50 or 60 are just out the window. Now you wear what you feel comfortable in and confident in, and that is different for everybody. And that is okay. Just because you wouldn't wear ruffles doesn't mean the rest of us shouldn't wear ruffles. But this one, well, I've already taken the tag off because obviously I'm keeping this, but I want to say it was like around $20. And y'all really liked a couple of the outfits that I wore it with. I wore it with those wide leg cuffed jeans and I wore it with the denim skirt and the blingy cowboy boots or cowgirl boots. And y'all really loved that outfit. So it's just a good white blouse that you can wear with a number of different looks. Speaking of this outfit, it has 
another best-selling element in it, and that is this pair of boots. These are from Madden NYC from Walmart, and these are just so great because they're neutral. You know, you've got the tan color, but then you've got the bling all across the foot and up the side. So this is perfect for your country music concerts that you may be going to, or just if you want to jazz up an outfit with some boots, or if your Halloween costume for this year <laughs> requires a pair of boots, maybe you're dressing up like Dolly Parton or Taylor Swift or whoever, this would be a great pair of boots for that. And for the money, this is just a really exceptional pair of boots. They're comfortable. They do have a lot of padding in here in the footbed. And it's probably about a three inch or two and a half inch heel. It's not, yeah, you know, probably two and a half. It's not that high at all. And they do have the partial zipper here to assist with getting them on. But these are just so fun. And it looks like a lot of you have enjoyed them. So let me know how you plan to wear these boots this fall. I usually put out two YouTube videos per week. There are occasions when I only do one if I'm traveling or have something else going on. But if you want to see daily content from me, you can always check out the LTK or Like to Know It app because that's where I post everything first and I post out there every single day. And I also post pretty much every single day on Instagram and Facebook. So you can catch reels over there, outfit ideas, other outfits that you might not see here on YouTube. And I also post other kind of content too, you know, just tips on exercise or diet and things like that. I've been posting those kind of things over on Instagram. So make sure you're following me on the Lights Know It app, Instagram, Facebook, and Pinterest. I have a Pinterest page as well. So this one outfit right here, <laughs> I guess a lot of you really liked because here is yet another element of this outfit that is on the top sellers for August. And that is the denim skirt from Chico's. And here it is. And yes, this skirt is really great because Chico's denim, if you've never tried it, their denim is not stiff and it always has stretch, and it's just a really soft denim. I know a lot of people don't like the way that stiff denim feels. I'm one of them. I have been spoiled <laughs> by the stretch in denim, and I don't wanna go back to the denim that doesn't have any stretch at all. And all the Chico's denim, you can just tell See how soft it is? It's not stiff, it's just really soft, like it's been washed, you know, a hundred times, and it does have nice stretch, and that makes this skirt just so comfortable. And it has a walking slit in the front, but as you can see, it's not that high, so you don't have to worry about it coming up too high and flashing anybody or anything like that. It's just, you know, about six or eight inches right there is all. And if you're petite like me, this is gonna come down past your knees. If you're average height or taller, it's probably gonna be right around your kneecap, somewhere above it or below it. I did not get the skirt in a petite, and I'm not sure if it comes in petite or not, but I'm wearing it in a size Chico's Zero, which is the equivalent to a four regular size. And I feel like it's very generously sized. So go with your normal size or size down. But this is the third element from this outfit <laughs> that made it onto the top 10 list. Okay, we're getting to the top three now. And at number three coming in is this top from Time and True from Walmart with the flutter sleeves. Again, it's the flutters. I had somebody comment about this top and how, you know, this top and the white top that I was too old for these ruffly sleeves. Well, guess what? These flutter sleeves or little ruffles are on lots of things this fall, so everybody can just get over it. <laughs> <laughs> that that is what's in style. And this is a women's wear brand. This is not teenagers. This is not juniors. This is a women's brand. And this top comes in so many pretty fall colors. I got this rich, you know, berry kind of color, and I've worn it in a couple of different 
ways and you've seen it in my videos. I've worn it with a couple of different denim skirts and y'all really liked this top. It's number three and it runs generously sized. I wear a size small. I feel like time and true in general runs pretty big. So you've got room to spare in this. Even though I've got a larger bust, it doesn't pull. It fits great and it doesn't have a low neckline, but it's not, you know, a tight crew neckline either. This is just a really nice top to wear in these warm days of early fall. Okay, number two on the list. And I was really shocked by this because I thought this would be number one. I really did. Just based on the comments and based on all the likes it got and all the comments it got on LTK and on Instagram, I thought this was going to be number one. And it's close. It's number two. And that is this Again, flutter sleeve, <laughs> sleeveless dress from Time and True from Walmart. And this is just the perfect for me and those of us who do live in warm climates. This is the perfect fall dress because we're not going to get those fall temperatures until the second half of October and into November. But we still want to dress like it's fall. So this is just perfect. You can wear this dress with sandals or with some booties to give it even more of a fall look. And then later on when it does cool off, you can add a cardigan or some other jacket on top of it. The one I chose is this pretty floral with the red background, but this dress comes in, I think, four different colorways, two plaids and two florals. The other floral is this similar design, but a black background and then the two plaids. And this dress is only, well, it doesn't say, it's under $20, I'm pretty sure. And you know, you can't, you couldn't make a dress for <laughs> hardly for under $20. So it's so pretty and it's 100% cotton. It has pockets and these little buttons that go up the front and the flutter sleeves. Yes, again, flutter sleeves, just so cute. And it's such a bargain. There's no wonder that it is this month's number two bestseller. Okay, we've made it to number one. Do you have any guess as to what might be the number one bestseller for August? There's a lot of different things it could be, but it is this, the Spanx Bralaluya Bra. Y'all are really loving this Spanx bra. And again, it's easy to see why. I featured it also in my bra video back in July, and it was one of my favorites too. And I've been wearing it a ton. Let me tell you, it is just the most comfortable bra because it's stretchy in the back, it fastens in the front, so it's very easy to put on and fasten. And then you got the adjustable straps that adjust in the front as opposed to the back. So love it. The only thing I would say about it is you might even be able to go down in your band size with this bra because the band is so comfy because it's so stretchy and it's a little bit generous with the stretch. So mine is okay, but next time I'm gonna try to go down one size in my band, not the cup, just the band size and see how that does. So keep that in mind. If you like your bras to be really snug and secure, you might consider going down one in your band, but your true size will work just fine too. So just keep in mind that you can't adjust it. Since this is a front closing bra, you don't have the different sets of hooks to tighten it. You only have the one chance, you know, to fasten it and get the right fit. So you might order two sizes and see which one feels better to you. One more thing I'm going to throw in as a favorite and I saw over in my Amazon analytics that a lot of you have bought this too. This is a beauty item and that is this lotion from Nivea. And this was the best price I could find was on Amazon because you got a two pack of big bottles for one price. And I am really, really enjoying this lotion. It's just really emollient and it makes your skin look good. You know, some lotion might be really rich and moisturizing, but it doesn't do anything for the look of your skin. This lotion gives your skin a nice glow and sheen. So if you are wearing shorts or a skirt or showing your arms or whatever, this lotion will not only provide great moisture for you, 
it also just gives you a nice luster to your skin. So I love it. It's my favorite lotion right now. So it looks like y'all are enjoying it a lot as well too. I hope you all enjoyed this video and remember everything is linked either down below or over here in the YouTube links that pop up on the screen. Thank you all for joining me today. And until I see you in my next video, have a stylish day. Bye.